I told you last summer, read this book. It's The Coming Insurrection. It's by the Invisible Committee. This is quite possibly the most evil thing I've ever read. And it's about to play out in the streets of Greece. It's been played out in France. The story, it's written by 12 people. Some of them are in jail now over in Europe. They're actual communists. They've been masquerading as democratic socialists. Oh, we're not Marxists. We're not communists. We're like you. And they got into bed with their politicians, their version of Nancy Pelosi. And they were backing those people. And according to the book, they realize those people aren't serious. Just like Van Jones and the left is starting to figure out that Barack Obama, they're starting to say, wait a minute, is this guy serious? Is he going to do it? We had an unspoken understanding. He's going to bring us the socialist utopia. Well, this is their manifest. And the message is, everyone in government has been lying to you. And that's why they call for the coming insurrection. This is evil stuff. These are the things that will free the worker. In it, one chapter on how to destroy the family. On Friday, I'm going to spend a full hour on Europe. Because everything that's happening over there is going to play out over here if we're not careful. You have to know the truth of the coming insurrection. By the way, this is the first English translation of it. I told you to find it last uh, uh, summer. It was hard to find you know, back east, it was hard to find, you know, this summer. Not hard to find today. We checked at the bookstores. Stanford, Berkeley, we got this at UCLA. I think Megan McCain said it best when she the other day said she was a, like, I'm like a progressive Republican. And then she followed and she said this. And I'm sorry, revolutions start with young people, not with 65-year-old people talking about literacy tests and people who can't say the word vote in English. Like, she's right, like revolutions start with, like, young people, like I think, like Lenin used to call them, like, useful idiots. More on this on Friday.